Some had hoped that year two of the pandemic would have ended on a more upbeat note given all the bloodshed throughout 2021. But alas, that would not be the case. The Jackmel community would be rocked by the murder of an elderly woman on the last day of the year. On Friday, December 31, 2021, law enforcement and first responders found a 70-year-old Florence Augustine, also known as Vina, unresponsive near her home in Blackstone, Jackmel, with marks of violence about the body. Initial reports indicate that the senior was strangled to death. The prime suspect in the case is reportedly the victim's son. What would drive someone to allegedly take the life of the person who brought them into this world? The family is still trying to piece together the details. Niece Emily Samuel says she heard someone calling for help before learning of what happened. When I heard the call, I walked on him. I told him what's his problem. He told me, is my aunt that's underground? Um, there was in a problem there, so I saw his body was dirty. I asked him what happened to him. He told me what happened. So I came, I see the lady underground. Samuel said she called emergency personnel and was instructed to check for a heartbeat. Augustine was later pronounced dead on the scene by medical officials. He told me to call the ambulance to take my aunt to the hospital. We called the um, the ambulance. We spoke to police. They asked me if the lady moving. I said I don't know because I didn't touch her. They tell me to check to see, and that's the time he had put him to sit down. After I check, I check to see if she had pearls and stuff. I didn't find any pearls on, on her. But it's when the police came, ambulance and stuff. The people came. They check on her, and they pronounce her dead. And that's the time we know she passed. The man used to be with her a very long time, but then people relationship was always there. He always used to be by her. They, that was a friend to her. This is the second senior citizen who has been the victim of a heinous attack in the past few weeks. Earlier in December 2021, a lone male intruder armed with a knife attacked a woman in her 90s at her home in Babuno. The executive director of the National Council of and for Older Persons has denounced the recent assaults on older persons. She says families need to do a better job at caring for older folks. It is we the children that are supposed to make sure that our mothers and our fathers are being taken care of. They are not alone because as far as I learned that the lady in Babu knows she lives alone. Where are the children? Does she have children? The other one in Jackmel, I was told, I'm not sure, that's what I was told and that's what I heard. It was uh, her own son who did her whatever that happened. So where do we go from here? Uh, if it happened to, we are the ones that are supposed to protect our elderly. We are the ones that are abusing them. So where do we go from there? Are we saying that government's supposed to do that for us? Government cannot do all. We are the ones that have to ensure that our elderly folks, mothers and fathers, are uh, taken care of. A post-mortem examination determined that Florence Augustine died as a result of strangulation. Her son, a 53-year-old construction worker and resident of Jackwell, Lenny Augustine, has been formally arrested and charged for causing her death. The accused was arraigned in the First District Court for a bail hearing on Tuesday, January 4, 2022. Florence Augustine would have celebrated her 71st birthday this month. Joachim Duplessis, HTS News Force.